ChatGPT's ability to create images just got way better. If you've been doing any sort of image generation from ChatGPT, historically it's been pretty junky. Anytime you need to create an edit, it misses the mark. You spend more time trying to create an image through ChatGPT with the editing that it'd probably just be quicker just to draw it yourself. Well, no longer is that the problem. ChatGPT fixed that issue. All right, let's dive in. So if you look right here, you can see on your ChatGPT 4.0 screen, what can I help you with? You hit these three buttons here. It's going to open up, create image, updated visual ideas and concepts. You want to click right there and it automatically defaults create image. And you can here, you can put whatever you want. What do you want to create an image of? You want to create a social media post. You want to create some sort of a picture for your blog, pictures for your website. This is next level. Let me show you. So in my case here, I'm actually speaking at a conference on Tuesday at uh, the 2025 BIA conference. So what I'm going to do, I'm just going to go ahead and grab this title right here, along with the summary of the session. I'm going to throw it into my prompt and tell it to create a social media post promoting my talk at the event. All right. So here's the prompt I, I made. Create image to promote my upcoming talk at the 2025 BIA conference. Here is the website for the conference. You can include the branding of the conference in the image. And there's the website. I have attached my photo and the OBIAA logo, so please include them in the image. My talk is titled Building Local Success, Insights and Strategies from Real World Digital Campaigns. It is from 2 to 3.30 p.m. on Tuesday, April 1st, 2025. All right, let's see what that comes up with. I included a couple images there as well. As you can see, I got the image of, uh, of me speaking along with that logo. I'm hoping it can get it into this image as closely as possible. Historically, ChatGPT has really failed at trying to mimic exactly what I ask it to do in an image. Let's see if it's improved. That does not really, I don't think that looks like me. It looks more like Don Draper from Mad Men. We might have to make some changes to this, but you know what? It's not bad, it's not terrible. I mean, I like how it didn't give me like as much salt and pepper as I actually have. So I appreciate that. But what I do like here is I like the ability that it's able to provide the exact text that I asked it to do because ChatGPT has not been able to nail text on image. But in this case here, it actually did a really good job. I'm impressed with that. The logo looks great as well. I like the little design. It actually uh, grabbed similar image, a similar image to what I uploaded. It actually added a little more to it. It's a similar shirt I was wearing, but the detail I think is quite impressive. I think it just kind of missed the mark on the actual face. Let's maybe give it a prompt. Let's see if we can edit it a bit. So we're going to edit and say, describe what you want to add. So what we'll say, um, can you make it something very vague, cool, and more like a rock flyer? Let's see what it comes up with. All right, so we got it back. I'm not mad about this. I actually like what it did. It gave it like this red tinge and it made it kind of grainy. Uh, I think that's kind of cool. I love what it did with the, with the font based off of that prompt me saying making it look cool and more like a rock flyer. It actually changed the image size as well to be more like a flyer, uh, which I'm quite impressed with. I actually really like this, but it still doesn't look like me. It's kind of a problem. So um, let's see if I can maybe cover up my face a bit and say, uh, not bad, but could you... God bandana and cool sunglasses to my face Let's see what it comes back with all right it took a couple minutes to load it's finally back this is what i got this is what i got so it, it's it's not bad it added sunglasses to my face it put a red bandana on my head it, this definitely looks rock star to me uh and it actually can kind of look like me now because now it's covering up my eyes and uh, it's covering up my eyes. And uh, I think I can pull that off. I think that looks pretty good. I think it did a really good job of uh, putting that together. I probably won't use this because it's not that type of event, um, but it definitely fulfilled my prompt quite nicely. And all the text is really good down here, except they messed up the logo a bit. 2025 BIA conference. It's the OBIA conference, but I ain't too mad about that. That's a simple, a uh, couple more edits and I'm sure it would hit the mark, but let's try one more example. So I'm grabbing this ad here, the Corona ad, 
And what I want to do is replace the bottle with this bottle here. I soon reach. It's a pretty big ask. Let's see what it can do. So it didn't like that prompt. It, uh, it came back and said it looks like there was an error while generating the image based on your request. It wasn't able to complete the replacement of the Corona bottle with the Turk's Head beer bottle in the beach scene. It's asking if I'd like to try to make adjustments. I said, please do your best to make a really good ad for Turk's Head beer using the example of the Corona ad for inspiration. So let's see what kind of image it can conjure up and come back with. Here we go. Voila. Pretty decent. Log off, lime in, find your beach, and it actually put the exact bottle there. This actually looks awesome. I actually really like this. It's almost like the quality of it is almost better than the original itself. Not bad. I like it. I love it. I bet you uh, Turk's Head Brewery would love it as well. That's awesome. So this is just giving you an idea of how good ChatGPT image creation has become. Now you can just think about the direction it's going to be going in the months and years to come with image creation, even stock photography websites. I'd be worried if I owned a stock photography website because now ChatGPT can make any stock photography on demand. Getty Images, look out. If you like this video, make sure you like it, subscribe uh, so you never miss a video. And uh, until next time, we'll see you soon. Thank you.